Hello? Wind Waker, you ever wake a wind before? Me either. But Linkovich here, he looks like he's having a good time. I don't know you. And I hope I never have to see you again. You either. You know what, actually? I think I, I think you deserve to, okay, you know what? I'm gonna leave that guy alone, he's insane. Hylia decided to give that plant teeth and I am not messing with it. Okay, mailbox. You need to calm down, buddy. If you're reading this letter, yes, I am at the moment, it can only mean you have peeked into one of our many post boxes. I am indebted to you. I am very sorry I let you leave without thanking you. Please accept this heartfelt apology. <laughs> Keep that in your mind. What? He said something about wiggling? Wait, let's go back. I'm just scanning over this. <laughs> if you see any wiggling post boxes, oh yeah, they're freaking. These post boxes are having an amazing day. Thank you, Kamali's father. Oh man, this dude is hooking me up. You won't see freaking this guy giving you heart pieces in this game. You really need to pull your weight around here, boat. And I weigh like five pounds. That's just not enough weight. You need more on you. Nah, for real though, I gotta be nice to this boat. So this place too, the, like like this, this is a companion in a Zelda game who doesn't interrupt you every five seconds. Kind of incredible actually. So, so this place too has been attacked by Ganon. Could he already be regaining his power? Oh God, I hope not. Someone freaking, someone's charging Ganon. Link, you must get the remaining pearl. It lies in a place northwest of here. We must set sail immediately. Now I'm thinking about someone trying to like revive like Ganon to back to life. And literally it's, it's just him and then there's like a freaking iPhone charger stuck into his butt or something. I don't really remember where I have to go, but I'm just trying to make Link dizzy. I think the arrow is telling me where to go. Okay, Wind, go in the same direction you were already going. Good job. Yep, I'm just double checking you're doing awesome. Oh, would you look at that? More water. I'm starting to get the impression that there's a lot of water in this game. <laughs> 8 out of 10. Too much water. I'm actually a video game reviewer now. Ah, dang it. I'm such a bad completionist. We forgot to feed the fish. So he would draw on my map. Little Link, my man, you need to get more artistic. You should draw your own map, dude. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, what do we got here? I see an island. Oh, yep. I remember this place. It may not look like it, but this place creeps me out. I mean, look, this is the perfect... Dude, this is the perfect vacation spot. You know, like, you totally should buy a timeshare for this kind of place, you know what I mean? But check this out. The thing is, I just do not want my literal door on my literal house to have a freaking full-on conversation with me. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> and look at the door handle. It's his freaking hand. And I bet you his palms are sweaty. Spaghetti. Oh, what happened to the light? That was so weird. See, this house is haunted. I just don't want to have to make eye contact with my own door. Please don't talk to me. Oh, <laughs> Don't touch me with those filthy hands, you mischievous little scamp. You're a you're a scamp. I don't even know what that means. Ahem, this cabana belongs to the master, and the master alone. You grimy, trespassing little scoundrel. Away with you! Away, I say! Dude, that guy's a freaking, freaking ding, ding dong. Usually, inanimate objects don't talk to me. So I'm gonna crawl under this freaking dude's house, and I'm gonna steal all his money. <laughs> he thought he could put all his money under his house and he didn't know this little caterpillar Linkovich was gonna crawl under here and take it all. But I will say it sure is freaking cozy here, you know? No choo-choos for miles. <gasps> oh, what is over there? Miles away right now. I think I see a Korok. Oh my gosh, I remember now. <laughs> they have this sad little tree and it's got a face. And it just does not look like it's doing too well. Oh my gosh, I know you're really trying your best to just repopulate the planet with trees so humans can live. But just humans just don't care. What do you need, buddy? Do you need something? I'm having a little conversation with a little seed man, okay? I am dying a lot. Koroks are cute. And you know, my headcanon is this Korok owns this lovely place. This whole property, he owns it. He, go he goes in that house at night. <laughs> makes himself a TV dinner, sits and chills, and just has a great life. Nothing bad ever happens to him, except for his tree home he kind of like is shriveling up. But like, yeah, I don't know. I'm just, let's pretend that's not happening to him. 
and he's having a good life. Don't worry about it, okay? He'll be able to cope. He just needs to do a little extra photosynthesis. So when I first played this game, I remember the storms, like back when I was a freaking 13 year old or whatever, and it was so cool. I couldn't believe the weather effects. I mean, it's still cool. To, I mean, I still think it's freaking awesome. But like the storms, I was like, oh my gosh, like that anxiety that I had because, you know, these kind of games were way, way more realistic when I was a kid. Realistic is not the right word to use for this art style, but I think you know what I mean. <laughs> Bro, just because you're a shark doesn't mean I'm not going to hit you with a boomerang. <laughs> God. All right. Well, now I know why no one wants to be a pirate these days. Holy smokes. Oh, your face is gr gross. Why is it so ugly? That thing's face should be in a museum for being just so hideous. That was a spectacle to behold. Speaking of spectacle rock, I don't remember what this place is called, but, um, yep, there's a big death cloud over it. So, you know, it's gonna, it's gonna be nice here, I think. Link, look, do you see it? Uh, no, I'm squinting. Could you turn the contrast up a little bit? <laughs> what has happened to this place? And I remember when I first, like, got to this place, I was like, oh my god. I was like, what happened? Like, it's just destroyed, and it looks so s cool because of that. What? What is the meaning of this? The island, it is... We're too late. I knew we had precious little time, but I never suspected how little. A great water spirit named Juban once lived here, but no, no sign of him remains. Hold it, Link! Huh. Who is it? My... F oh, good, fly on over here. You're my friend. So you're here. I've been looking for you. Holy smokes. Thanks for coming out to hang out with me on this absolutely deserted island. <laughs> Are you by chance seeking the great spirit, Jaboon? I'm sorry to report to you that Jaboon can no longer be found here. <laughs> Just look at how this place has been torn to pieces, to shreds. I suppose this too is the work of the shadow in the forsaken fortress. Oh man, that poor fish must have got turned into sushi. Oh, what? But fear not, Jaboon was able to flee this island before it was attacked. He is in a safer abode now. Would you like to guess where they abode may be? <laughs> on the island where you were born, on outset. Well, you told me to guess, and you didn't give me a chance to guess. But I still love you, my man. Even in this terrible lighting, your beak looks fantastic. It's so pointy and yellow. <laughs> Yet, even if you were to go to Outset now, you would not be able to see Jaboon. The cave where he hides is sealed with a mighty stone slab that repels all who try to pass it. Why, not even the pirates with their m mighty ship can get in. I must apologize, Link. I thought if anyone would know of your whereabouts, it would be the pirates. I told them this tale with, with, without so much as a thought of the consequences. I don't know what they hoped to get, but they immediately let sail, set sail for Outset Island and tried to break into the cave. <laughs> They're pirates, dude. It is lucky they could not gain entrance. I have heard that they were last spotted on Windfall Island, but doing what? I do not know. If you wish to see Jaboon, I think you'd better search the pirates on Windfall Island. What an eerie isle this is. Everywhere else boasts clear skies and calm seas, but this place suffers under dark clouds and rain. Oh, I see. This place is just the physical manifestation of the YouTube comment section. <laughs> Valu must have been right when he asked me to bring word of Jaboon to you. He called this island cursed. Oh, okay. Should I step on the sand then? Is this cursed sand? Wait, my little toe is feel tingly. Help me. I would counsel against staying here longer than you have to. But that is your decision. I have told you of Jaboon, so my task is complete. No, no, no. Don't fly away. No! Don't leave me with the YouTube comment section! Oh, this algorithm is a trap! Help, please! Wait, maybe there's a light at the end of the tunnel. Maybe there's a subscribe button under this rock! Oh, absolutely nothing. Again, 13-year-old Keegan remembers this place, and I was just like... Oh my god. I was just like, did just like everyone here just like die? Like, Ganon's that brutal in this game? And then I also tried to like explore all up in there, but you can't really get too many places here wait what is that oh my god you are telling me right now that everyone died except beetle that is no freaking coincidence no beetle killed all these all these people it was beetle and then he blamed it on ganon we all know the real villain here explain to me this who is he selling his goodies to right now <laughs> to ghosts no way Everyone here's dead. They have no more currency left. All right, Boatman, I want to go home. <sighs> Give me fast travel right now. 
<laughs> we need to get out of here. So Jaboon has survived. The sea spirit has lived through the trials of many long years. He must have caught wind of Ganon's attack beforehand. If we are able to believe the words of the Rito postman, dude, that dude has always been good. Do not question him, okay? Then the pirates know something about the cave where Jaboon hides. Why don't we go first to Windfall and search for them there? Oh god, no beetles trying to cut us off! Oh, swerve! Oh my god! Oh, I will drown you! Bro, we've been driving for like an hour. Can I- can we stop at a rest stop? Can I step out to pee? Also, um, what do you think you're doing, fishy guy? Little shark man? Bye bye Why? No one wanted to see you? Today? <sighs> oh wait, I have a- I got a weapon! Little did you know? <laughs> oh man, freaking- Oh, oh my god, what the heck? Oh, the camera just freaked the heck out. <laughs> All right, there you go, buddy. Quit looking at me. <laughs> what is happening? Oh, do I have to actually hit every single eyeball all at once? Bro, how do you expect me to poke out every single one of your eyeballs? Oh, wait, no, it's happening. Things are happening. I'm killing him. Oh, please, don't suck in me. Don't suck me yet. <laughs> oh, 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 I'm so close. No, no, no. Oh, dang it. All right, well, we didn't kill the octopus or the squid. <laughs> oh, remind me. Next time we fight that squid and I hit the f hit the final blow on him, make sure that like I go go back to Splatoon, you squid. I think he would think that was really funny while he was dying, you know. And at least he like goes out laughing. Don't even tell me that Beetle beat me here. What the heck? They didn't even invent engines yet. Oh look, it's a big pirate ship. Who would have guessed? It is just as the postman told us, the pirate ship has stopped here to avoid drawing the attention of the townsfolk. Oh, they're being sneaky and sneaking in in the middle of the night. I know not what they are researching, but if they are hoping to get their hands on Jaboon's secret gem. <gasps> Jaboon's secret gem? They're going to steal that gem, sell it on Facebook Marketplace for like five bucks, and we need that thing, dude. I doubt they would tell anything directly to you if you were to ask them. No, me and Tetra are freaking homies. Link, I told... I think you should try to find out what the pirates are up to without them finding out about you. Okay. Metal Gear Solid sneaky time. Okay, I love when we get to do that. Ah, yes. Windfall Island. Oh, this is where I get the tingle flashbacks. I get the tingle tingles. <laughs> Why did we free tingle onto this world? I would say that we should check and make sure that the uh, pirates are not doing bad things. Hey, are you dead still? Just checking. Okay, that guy's still dead. Hey, sometimes dead people come back to life in Zelda games, okay? That's a thing that happens. The ship's only tooth is a... What? So what I've always wondered is... <laughs> no, no, that's completely wrong. Okay, buddy. You know my voice. You should let me in. <laughs> oh, we shouldn't have jumped on here. Now we're gonna have to swim through the water. Oh, 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 wait. Okay. I wanted to climb the mast. Anyways, um, I just always wondered, like... So, are there different passwords for that, okay? And if you know all the passwords, like if you Wikipedia it or something, if, like, you can actually input the password before you do, like, what I'm supposed to go do. Buddy, you are just still having such a good time. You're dancing around, and you're probably going to get struck by lightning. You should get inside. I also love how this part of the game... Oh, dear God. <laughs> I love how this part of the game, like... It forces the thunderstorm to be happening. It makes it really spooky. It's kind of cozy. I don't I don't know if I've ever said this, but I like when it rains in video games. Oh, there's nobody around. You would expect someone to be awake with this freaking thunderstorm being so loud. The only lights that are on are that one and that one. <laughs> the little tingle light. Gosh dang it. Yeah. Yeah. The tingle. Pfft. What's his name? Beetle. Oh my god. <laughs> Beetle, tingle, same thing. They're both the bad guys of the game. <laughs> But you'd expect Tingle to have to sleep, but guess what? No, he's some freaking evil deity, so he doesn't have to sleep. Oh my god, I almost jumped off the edge. Determination. How convenient let you let these vines grow on your house. Oh, how convenient there's a hole in your house for me to crawl into. I- Link, no, you have to crawl. <laughs> I wonder what could be going on in here. Honestly, I should just let the pirates be pirates. They're not doing anything wrong, except for tying up an old man. <laughs> Look, don't be mad at us. It's not our fault that we absolutely gotta have bombs to get the treasure we're after. 
<laughs> How about you just think of it as payback for the nasty little monopoly you've been running here, yeah? <laughs> okay, you guys, you're really teaching him a lesson. You know, he can't breathe with that thing on his face, but okay. So I bet you're thinking it was foolhardy to ask pirates to pay such an outrageous price, huh? Yep, I bet you are. Oh my god, you're pirates. You probably have treasure. Just give him one little piece of gold. You have you have so much of it, you know? Uh, you know, Gonzo, I still can't get over the bit of fast talking you pulled to get that information out of the postman. <gasps> you beat up a mailman? <laughs> huh? Oh, oh yeah, that was smooth. I can never I, I can never tell who's talking in this game, so it's so hard to give him voices. Uh, I can tell you the minute I set my eyes on that link, I just knew he was so sexy and he was totally my soulmate. Oh yeah, same, I agree. That's why I always wear these v-necks around him. <laughs> so when I saw that postman, I just pretended like, oh, they're talking about the bird, and presto, he spills the beans. <laughs> Oh, hopefully they're not refried beans, because that would be sticky. Someone could slip on that. Oh, good work, Gonzo. Really, just top-notch. It's funny, though. I'm thinking this is maybe the first time you've shown such wit, such cunning. <laughs> you know, with your cunning and Miss Tetra smarts, if you two got married and had a kid... Uh, gross, what are you talking about? Dude, that kid would be the greatest pirate to ever uh, sail the seas. Yup, the greatest. <laughs> You idiot! Keep your mouth shut, yeah? Don't be so dummy. <laughs> Miss Tetra, are you listening to this nitwit? Can't you dock him some pay or something? Look at Tetra over there just being freaking so cool. <laughs> Keep your childish jokes to yourselves and get those bombs back to the ship. The second you're done loading them up, we're setting sail for Outset Island. Oh my god, they're gonna blow up my home. What, miss? We have to leave immediately. But it's been so long since we were on shore. We need to fill our bellies with some good eating, yeah? No, you know what? Just eat the rats that live on your boat. You'll be fine. They don't have any diseases, I promise. I tested it out myself. I let them nibble on me sometimes. I mean, uh, I'm fine either way, of course. I don't have to eat, you know, because, like, that's how I keep my, you know, my v-neck physique looking good. It's just that the boys were so excited to come to town. Yeah, <laughs> the boys. And I can't help but think it would be awfully hard on them to leave so soon without a proper layover. What is it? What are you doing? You're going to get a neck cramp. Stop that. You're making me dizzy, dude. Say we set sail tomorrow. Yeah. What do you say, miss? That treasure isn't going anywhere. Oh, yeah. Like, no, I'm not sneaking around. Who the heck is that guy? <laughs> I've never. <laughs> I swear I never saw that one. You're with me, right, boys? Who's who's for a night of fun? <laughs> we don't have fun around here, okay? <sighs> we play Wii U games. <laughs> you're all fo uh, oh, you're all fools. Do you know that? Uh, you saw the demolished island. You saw the senseless destruction. Oh, see, she she's like, dude. We have to freaking we have to be heroes and stuff. We have to hurry on to outset, or the same thing could happen there. Oh, see, she doesn't want to blow up my town. She wants to save it from getting blown up by um, blowing it up. I get it. <laughs> Not to be disrespectful, but by the sound of things, you're worried more about that island than the treasure, miss. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. I want, you know, the treasure. <gasps> no, it's not me, I swear. I'm a caterpillar. <laughs> uh, All right, fine. Have it your way. We can leave town tomorrow, you big Babies. Say there, brother. What was today's password again? <laughs> Marco, are you serious? You forgot already? You're so useless. Quit being a bully, okay? He probably has memory loss from looking at your freaking terrifying face. Today's word is barnacle. Yeah, remember? <laughs> oh my god, in post, or like when I edit this, remind me. <laughs> remind Did he call him a pickle? Barnacle. Yeah, I got it. Remind me to like just... Uh, uh, bleep it out like they do in Spongebob. Oh wait, no, they say barnacle because it is how they beep out slur wo swear words, right? I don't remember. They do dolphin noises, right? Oh my god, I don't know my Spongebob lore. Oh my god, I cut my- I cut the top of my head off. You know what? Y you know, well, you're tied up here, I might give you a little haircut. Actually, I think someone already did give him a haircut. One side is a looking a little different than the other side. Space buns, huh? That's a brave choice for you, Mr. Shopkeeper. <laughs> Uh, there's probably nothing in here. I just want to steal all his stuff. Because I'm trying to be a pirate, you know? 
I mean, I'm not very good at being a pirate. I'm a little more better at being like a hero of the wind. But you know, I'm trying, I'm learning. You know what, maybe I can take a few of these bombs while I'm in here. I'm gonna drop this. I'm planning on taking this uh, barrel with me. No, I can't get up there. Fine, I'll take the barrel then. I just have to at least loot something. You know, he's tied up, you know? He can't do anything about it. All right, buddy, see you later. No! That barrel was my freaking friend. I whispered sweet nothings into his ear. Gosh dang it, I told him secrets. And now no one knows those secrets except me. And <laughs> gosh dang it. All right, let's go get our freaking barnacle on. Are you still dead? I'm just checking. Okay, yep, he's still dead. Don't worry, guys. I was checking again for you guys. All right, barnacles, let's get going. The ship's only tooth is a... Do I have to capitalize it? Is that going to be a thing? I, I feel like I... No. Not a narnacle. A barnacle. <laughs> oh my god. I don't even ha know how to spell barnacle. This is how bad I am at spelling. Like, in my head, this is what it... Sh what How I think it's spelled. <laughs> Bar-nickel. <laughs> Gosh dang it. But I know that's not it. bar nickel. No, it's barnacle. Barnacle. That's totally it, dude. I'm a freaking smarty pants. Right, right. You may enter. Who was guarding the door? If all the pirates were there in the bomb shop, who was actually guarding it? Maybe it was the door. <sighs> yeah, I'm sick of doors talking to me. That's probably what it was. Hey, Tetra, I'm in your room. I'm gonna read your freaking diary. Dang, Tetra, your mom is hot. I hope that's not my mom. I hope we're not brother and sister. Oh, God. All right, you little mop bucket. You better not make me do an obstacle course. Oh, gosh dang it. My old swabby link. <laughs> so you're alive. All the other pirates said you got done in by that bird monster in the Forsaken Fortress. So I thought. Oh, yeah. He tried to eat my entrails, but, like, I actually ate his entrails. Actually, Ganon threw me into the ocean. It was actually really traumatizing. <laughs> Never mind what I thought. You're alive. Oh, I get it now. You came back because you missed me so much. Yeah, I did. I'll give you a kiss after we have this conversation. I had no idea you wanted to be my swabby so badly. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> well, after you left, I went back to being the bottom rung on the ladder, if you know what I mean, <laughs> which is why I'm stuck here while everyone else is in town having fun and eating and stuff. They let you just sit here and starve? Oh my god, dude. Are you serious? But I guess being uh, wor being so worshipped by the my swabby ought to cheer me up. Yes. Yep, I'm here to worship you, buddy. The whole world revolves around you. Alright, why don't you do a test? Oh my god. Lanterns. Okay. Uh, platforms. That was last time, but now there aren't any, which means you have to jump from one rope to... The oh my god. Oh my god. You did not just jump that gap. Dude, that guy is... Oh my god, he's on deity level with freaking Beetle. Holy crap. The switch that opens to the gate. Okay, cool. I'll step on it. Cool. Oh, he's gonna give me bombs? Is that what he said? Oh, good. Lock yourself in there. I do... I, you know what? Now I can leave. He trapped himself in there. Good thing. Now he's gonna... <laughs> he's gonna starve to death and also starve to death. If I fall down, am I gonna get like eaten by rats or something is that what's about to happen hiya hiya oh okay oh phew. wait am i too too small now oh no wait 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 i think i got too small oh, dang it well i have to just retry no oh, okay Whew. okay i don't want the rats to eat me i was joking when i said that they nibble on me i don't want them to do that i don't want scurvy you get scurvy from rats right that's not like a salt deficiency, right? Or a salt deficiency. Uh, or a vitamin C deficiency. Whatever. I don't know what vitamins are. What? You gotta be... You did it already? You're... You're incredible. You jumped that gap, dude. No, you actually are... You are... You deserve to be worshipped. This isn't good. I've never been... I've never even passed this test. Dude, don't be freaking modest, my man. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, okay. Uh, okay. Yep, you're gonna give me bombs. I'll just give you the bombs. Go ahead and take them. See, there you go. That, it pays to freaking love somebody. Oh, he's, he's watching, he's keeping guard for me? Well, I'll take these. Explosives. In the hands of a five-year-old. Everything will be fine. Nothing could go wrong. I won't lose any limbs. It'll be a blast. <laughs> a blast, because they're bombs. Oh! 
Uh oh. She heard me. Oh, I forgot. She has freaking. <laughs> she has a. What's that called? An. Uh. Uh, air tag. What uh, the the iPhone thing where you can stalk people? From the look on your face, I have to guess you haven't saved your sister yet, huh? Oh wow. <laughs> I'm trying my best. Like that's the only reason I left home. <laughs> no one else would have parted with our treasure so easily. I assure you. And just how do you intend to use those bombs anyway? Don't tell me you're going after Jaboon's treasure too. Oh, you gonna you think you're gonna beat me there? My boat is really fast. All right, King of Red Lions. Oh my gosh, we are gonna go. Uh, we're gonna steal Beetle's freaking engine on his boat and install it onto you. You'll be fine. Or maybe we can find some NOS. Is there any fast cars around that we can steal some NOS from? Can you steal NOS off of a car? I don't even know what NOS is. Boost. I need a boost. All right. All we gotta do is find a rather large fish, convince him to give us the shiny sphere. And no one gets hurt. This mailbox wants to talk to me so bad. Who's sending me letters? I don't have any fans. Honestly, they're probably just letters from Ganon. And he's just they just say, Oh, I can't wait to kill you. <laughs> well done, our preparations are complete. If what the girl says is true, the pir pirates won't be leaving until morning. You must meet with Jaboon and get the pearl from him before they arrive. Let us delay no longer. <sighs> it, al it almost sounds like they're put it in, putting in the towel, you know? Like, I kind of feel like this is kind of unfair. Why is that treasure chest invisible? That makes me feel weird. Why are you an invisible bibble treasure chest? What happened to- oh, That treasure chest died and that's a ghost! Who would kill a treasure chest? Like, what a monster. Oh my god. My house is- Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, here's another 45 minutes to get here. Wait, just a minute. When did I get this? Who even gave this to me? What? I- Oh, okay, I'm just- You know what? I'm just so bewildered, I'm gonna go drown myself in- out in the ocean. See you later, Mr. King. You are totally a king. I wanna know who gave a cannon to a freaking small child. <laughs> gosh dang it. Oh, they're bombs. Oh my gosh, of course. They're bombs. Now I know. You know, for a seven-year-old, Link gets away with a lot of things in this game. Like, oh my gosh, he should at least- like, you should get grounded for having a cannon. Hey, honey. Um, we, we heard some loud explosions in your room, and we're, we're, we're worried that you might, you might have a cannon. Do you have a cannon, honey? <laughs> Do you, are you operating a cannon in your room? Honey, we heard you say Avast ye mateys. Um, we're worried about you. How did this whole map fit on a GameCube? I'm just so confused. It's too big. <laughs> this is like Skyrim map big. I know it's not actually, but I can pretend. No more detours. I have a fish to bomb. You leave me alone, Mr. Frickin' Face. You would think I would be thinking of commentary, but no, I'm just eating Cheez-Its. Oh my lord, how are there so... How are there so many little treasure spots? Wait, is this normal? One, two, three, four, five? What? See, whenever I do this... I never get it. Like, ever. I completely miss it, and I sit here for like... I've sat here for like, just, see? I... T <laughs> it's like those claw machine games at the bowling alley. You never freaking... Oh my god, I got it. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm just getting the Triforce pieces out of the way early. <laughs> oh, is it a fish? Okay, I, I was just hoping Jaboon was in there. More money. For a freaking five-year-old, though, that's good. Maybe he can buy more weapons. Oh, I think I see my home. It's being lit up by the lightning. That's not ominous at all. Ah, <sighs> home sweet home, everybody. It's great to be back. <laughs> Dude, imagine if they decided, if the, the team making this game decided to take a dark turn and you get home and it is just decimated. <laughs> oh, have you noticed, Link? Morning has not broken since we arrived at Great Fish Isle. Actually, that's very concerning. <laughs> Perhaps this is the curse that Valu spoke of. Whatever the reason, if this night does not end. Oh yeah, this is called like the Endless Night or something. That's so brutal. In fact, it might not be a bad idea for you to visit your hometown and family again after such a long time away. You know what? I actually think that's a bad idea. You would think it's a good idea, but I do not want my heart broken today. Real Wind Waker OGs will know what I'm talking about. Why are there monsters? 
In my home? My home sweet home? This is where I rest my head. How dare you be blobbing around? Mailbox, this is no time to celebrate. Did you notice there are monsters afoot? Oh my god. So I know where Fishy Man is. Oh, did you see his head? God, are you okay? God, I thought you broke your literal neck. Why won't you let me on you, dude? I am not gonna freaking go see my grandma. My grandma's perfectly fine, okay? She's have she's perfectly fine. What do you want? <laughs> I cannot say when we'll have a chance to return. It would be wise for you to show your family members that you're alive. Grammy, Grandma, Graham Cracker, I'm coming to see you. Graham, Graham, it's me, Linkovich. Oh, hey, Grandma. Oh, oh. <laughs> Link, Errol, don't go, don't leave. Uh, don't leave your poor old Grandma. I know I'm, like, voicing this silly, but this makes me want to cry. All alone. Like, I'm not kidding. I'm literally not even kidding you. Like, that just makes me absolutely want to cry. <laughs> it actually breaks my heart. I wasn't kidding. Okay, Boat, I'm coming back. Thanks for traumatizing me, you freaking big freaking dummy jerk. Dummy thick dummy jerk. Get out of here, Beetle. I don't want you. To, I don't want to see you. Okay, let's go find Jaboon. Let me on. <laughs> Are you ready? If that's the case, then we must search for the cave around the backside. Oh, you literally know exactly where to go? I don't know. <laughs> Okay, freaking genius, mind reader, okay. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. Remember when you were gonna be the third dungeon in this game and then it didn't happen? Why is there a whirlpool in my house right now? <sighs> okay, where's the squid, huh? Don't worry, everybody. Hiya! Get it! Oh my god, go further! Oh my gosh. <laughs> Can we build a better cannon? Mr. Frickin' Guy. Okay, now we got it. I'm just gonna blow it up right here. Skabam! Skaboom! Okay, just rapid fire. Just go, go, go. Get it. Get it. Destroy it. Come on. <laughs> okay. How many bombs does it take? I only have freaking 19 of them. <laughs> Alright, well, there's one little piece. Great. I'm really making some progress. Okay, really am making some progress. All right, fish, stop playing games. You really gotta let me in. I am about to drown to death. To literal death. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> oh. <sighs> Protected by a whirlpool. Good thing we did that, though, because the, you know, the Tetra could have been sucked away, and that would have been just, that would have ruined the whole game. Oh, it's so cozy in here. I really do like the water effects on the walls. They look really good. Uh-oh. Uh oh, you guys. Oh no. <gasps> oh, fishy. No, oh, okay. What? <laughs> I, lo I love his little lantern. Okay, this is the thing. Since he has a lantern, what if what if he is uh, what if he actually is dead? I actually don't know. Uh, <laughs> well met indeed, Jaboon. I am pleased to see that you are safe. Well, he could be dead. That might be what he's saying right now. We don't know. Yes, it seems Ganon has returned. There can be no other explanation. <laughs> Alright, well, I guess you can eat me. Fine. <laughs> Unfortunately, that is not so. Okay, can you guys tell me what you're talking about, please? Translate for me. The one I have brought with me has no connection to the legendary one. And yet, I sense great promise in the courage that this one possesses. Oh my gosh. For you guys who don't know, that is actually... The lore behind this game is too good. My god. Uh, I do. It is the only way. What's the only way? What do you mean? Can you guys tell me what's going on, please? <laughs> oh, I'm gonna catch it. I got it. Oh, it just floated right down to me. Hello. <laughs> oh, so shiny. It's burning my eye sockets. Okay, bye-bye, Mr. Fish. See you later. Are you just gonna live here? All right. <laughs> So that foul rain and endless night were indeed elements of a curse brought on us by Ganon. He must intest to ca intend to cast this land into pure darkness for all time. God, that is actually so brutal. I believe I have. You believe you've what? Oh my god, what? What are you guys planning? <laughs> They're making plans without me. I see how it is. Thank you guys so much for freaking watching. Alright everybody, I made the curse go. Bye bye, you guys can wake up now. <laughs>
Wait, what? But thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked what you saw, hit some buttons. There's a couple buttons there, you know, the subscribe and the like and the dislike button. <laughs> Go ahead, smack them all, shmoosh them all. Uh, I love you guys all so much. Thank you for watching. Thank you for the support. Like, it's, it's always awesome. And uh, I will see you guys in the next episode of whatever I film. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Swimming in the sea, so much fun.